everlasting life and heaven. Amen. And finally, but finally, we, we present to you a special candle, the baptismal candle, that she will have, please God, for the rest of her life. And you'll be able to bring it out on special occasions and remind her of her baptism. Perhaps when she makes her first Holy Communion, maybe when she's confirmed, you can bring it out and light it on those days for a short while. Don't let it burn down. But just light it and say, this is your baptismal candle. So, we light this on the pastel candle. This large candle This candle, the Easter Vigil, was lit in the past of the fire. This candle was also placed in the water to consecrate the water to the blessing of the, of the Easter Vigil. So she's been baptized from that water with this past of the candle designated. So we light the, the baptismal candle for And what we do now is pass this light on to you. Just as we've taken the light from the large candle, Giving it to a small candle. It symbolizes the passing on of faith from grown ups to children. So, receive the light of Christ. Parents and godparents, this light is entrusted to you to be kept burning brightly. This child of yours has been enlightened by Christ. She is to walk always as a child of the light. May she keep the flame of faith alive in her heart. When the Lord comes, may she go out to meet him all the saints in the heavenly kingdom. Amen. Amen. So now I'd like to invite uh, David and Rose and, and Levi and Terry just to come with me onto the sanctuary.